My name is Ron Nahum, and I'm a high school senior from Thomas Jefferson High School for Science and Technology. Today, I'll be presenting a novel computer vision approach to kinematic analysis of handwriting with implications for accessible assessment of neurodegenerative diseases. I conducted this research under the advisement of Mr. Kyle Jackson, Dr. Zoran Durich, and Dr. Lynn Gerber of George Mason University. To preface this work, fine motor movement ability and handwriting in particular has been established as a biomarker for both Alzheimer's and Parkinson's diseases. However, in previous and current studies, handwriting data is solely collected with digitizing tablets. These digitizing tablets are non-standard hardware and are thus expensive and inaccessible to patients and clinicians. At the same time, they're also unfamiliar to patients and difficult for them to use, while also being limited in their scope of collectible data. In this research, I developed a system to extract fine motor movement information from videos of handwriting and then assess patients' conditions based on this extracted data. A system developed to assess fine motor ability with computer vision offers a rapid and accessible solution, necessitating only a standard commodity camera, such as one on a smartphone or laptop, for accurate data collection. This low hardware burden enables greater access to diagnostic information in low-income areas and resource-poor health systems, leading to earlier diagnoses and improved treatment outcomes. The developed algorithms for fine kinematic data extraction from videos were tested using the system depicted in Figure 1, which entailed simultaneous data collection with a smartphone camera and digitizing tablet. And this setup was used to record 146 handwriting tasks. The actual data extraction was done using a novel recurrent region of interest feature matching algorithm developed in this research, which primarily uses previous position, velocity, and acceleration information to predict the location of the pen in the future, which decreases tracking error. The system was combined with perspective transform matrices to make a robust and efficient system for fine data extraction. An enhanced machine learning framework was then developed to classify patients based on this collected information. The PAHA dataset of handwriting movements was downsampled and filtered to stimulate vision-based data, and features were then extracted and selected by significance testing to create a final feature set. These were then used to train an ensemble classifier with tenfold cross-validation to provide generalizable diagnostic assessment accuracy. So shifting over to results, in the 146 handwriting tasks collected, the novel system achieves positional accuracy within half of a millimeter, and speed and acceleration mean absolute errors were less than 1.1%. Here you can see a comparison of the novel vision-based system in blue to the tablet-based system in orange for representative spiral and word writing tasks. These visuals display the high accuracy of the system for not just positional information, but also for speed, acceleration, and jerk in motions of varying complexity. The classification structure outlined achieved 74% accuracy in distinguishing Parkinson's disease patients from healthy controls, and it's currently pending further data to assess its literature-supported use in Alzheimer's disease and mild cognitive impairment assessment. Overall, this research has demonstrated that computer vision systems can be used to extract high-accuracy fine motor movement data in handwriting, and that this data can in turn be used for high-accuracy diagnostic assessments with machine learning. The technology demonstrated here offers an accessible and accurate solution for neurodegenerative disease screening enabling increased access to essential medical information in resource-poor health systems around the world. Furthermore, the system can be easily set up both at home and in office at little to no cost, offering a testing, screening, and monitoring solution that takes just a few minutes and is accuracy rivaling that of the clinical process. Thank you for listening, and feel free to contact me at the QR code or email on the poster with any questions or comments.